So today's video is going to be fairly quick, but we're going to be taking a look at some new Real Madrid player faces for FIFA 19. Now these images were posted on the official Real Madrid store where you can buy the jerseys. For some reason they were posted there, I'm not sure why, but it's good for us because we get to take a look at some new faces. So share this video with a friend and leave a thumbs up for me. Let's get to 300 likes. And if you're new around here, tap the subscribe button today and the notification bell because this is the number one place on YouTube for player faces. Now my pronunciation game is going to be very bad today, so I do apologize in advance. But first up we have Danny Ceballos and uh, he's got a new face now, brand new. Never before seen because in FIFA 18 he was generic. Now for career mode players, this guy has an overall of 78 in FIFA 18, but his potential is 88. So... Uh, very promising player and finally gets a real face and by the way These are the best images you can get on the website, but we move on to the next player, which is Vallejo or Vallejo I don't know, but um, yeah, finally a new face for this guy. He was generic in FIFA 18 So this is a brand new face added to the game This player face update was known for a few months now, but today we get to confirm it Lucas Vazquez does get a real face now in FIFA 19 the main difference is he's got a haircut and There's a nice high quality image on the right for you guys to take a look at Next up we have Kovacic who gets a new face now in FIFA 19, of course was generic in FIFA 18 but the photo on the left was taken from the Journey trailer so if you look at that trailer you will see that face, I had to brighten it up a little bit so you can see it, everything's always dark in those trailers, I don't know why but yeah, new face for Kovacic as well. The next person you're going to have to read it yourself, I can't pronounce and if I try it's going to sound very bad but this guy is uh, 20 years old or 21 now I believe. Overall, he's 72, potential is an 84, and he's a striker. And if you take a look at the real life photo, his FIFA 19 one matches up pretty nicely with it. He's got the same hairstyle and uh, looks pretty good. So over the last week or two, I have been saying that Ramos could be updated, but we needed a better photo. Today we get that better photo, and we get to confirm that Ramos has indeed been updated. He had an alright face in FIFA 18. It didn't really look much like him in the end, but I'm glad they updated it now. FIFA 19's one does look better. And it looks more like Sergio Ramos now than the FIFA 18 one. He's had a slight hair update, I believe, and the beard looks a little bit different as well. I reckon this guy is going to be a career mode gem. He's already got an 85 potential in FIFA 18. I reckon FIFA 19's one's going to go even higher than that. Theo Hernandez. The biggest change here is that he's gone from blonde hair to black hair now. But in all seriousness, it is a nice face update for a pretty good player. A very young player. He's only 20 years old. Next up, we have Marcos Lorente who has an 86 potential, which is fantastic. Currently 78 overall in FIFA 18. Um, nice new face for him, nice hairstyle he's got in the FIFA 19 image. Uh, it's good because a lot of these youngsters are now getting updates and they're going to be great for career mode. All these players are like already 78 overall. They're like 22 years old and they've got potentials in the high 80s. So it's going to be fantastic to get these guys in career mode, especially now with a real face. And he is the last player for today's episode. I think EA... Have done a good job now. I think most of the Real Madrid team now has real faces besides those reserve players. And the Vinicius Junior guy, the new signing. I hope he gets a real face or at least a custom. It's going to be bad if he's got a generic face. The guy is a talent. He's going to be a first teamer for sure. Great potential in FIFA 19. Uh, I wish he gets a real face. I hope he doesn't have that generic face. It's going to let the whole thing down. But um, yeah, so far most of the Real Madrid team does have real faces now, which is good. And Atletico Madrid are the same now as well. And we just need to work on that Vinicius Junior real face, and then we're all good. So those are all the new Real Madrid player faces we could see at the moment. The rest of the players in the Real Madrid squad have stayed the same with their faces. And uh, remember that Asensio and Casemiro were updated recently in the World Cup update. Anyway, I hope you did enjoy today's little update. Follow me on Instagram at Apex Camera. I do post a lot of FIFA stuff on there as well. Trying to grow that account, so it would help if you could follow that. And if you want to watch another FIFA 19 video, tap the thumbnail right now. And if you want to subscribe to the channel, tap the VK icon underneath the thumbnail, and I'll see you next time.